Uh, so, so uh, if you remember, we have been uh, working on the uh, tourist ropeway project for Shillong and other parts of the state for almost two years now. And we have faced a large number of uh, hurdles, uh, be it uh, clearances, be it finance, um, be it uh, you know legislations that have to be done. So basically, this process has taken us a long time. But we are now finally at the point where we have put, uh, we have taken the necessary permissions from everywhere. We finalized the locations. We have got all the uh, now the act also will be passed in the uh, the bill will be passed and will become an act in the assembly. And uh, this is a tendering process also after that in the next 15 to 20 days will take place. So all this is happening in terms of the tourism aspect. The the aspect that you're mentioning about is regarding for commuters and whether we can have ropeways uh, for public transportation. Uh, that of course is also uh, in our radar, but uh, the planning and implementation for that is much more larger and much more complicated. It's not a very simple project, but definitely in the long run, it will help us to ease the traffic. Uh, and definitely it's an option that we will explore. But uh, for the immediate, we have come out with this particular Meghalaya Ropeway Bill 2022 starting with the tourism part and slowly we'll expand this and incorporate other parts of uh, urban transportation even for goods transportation and um, all other forms of uh, ropeways that uh, that you know that may be required in the future but as of now it's mainly for the purpose for tourism